Now, you have a chain around your neck today yeah. that says O Block. Yeah. That's a block you represent. For sure. What was O Block like when you were growing up? Nervous. People Nervous. hear about that phrase, O Block. Be what like, was it really like? It was like a jungle. <laughs> it was fun too, but when you look back, that shit was dangerous. But it was fun to us because we was young. It's, it's just like you in a zoo, you in there with like, snakes, rats. Lions, tigers, whales, all type of shit. <laughs> you just in that bitch trying to survive. There's a lot of shit going on. You gotta be aware. But a lot of that shit, it, it was kind of fun. But when you look back, it was dangerous. Cause we lost a lot. We lost a lot enough. Is there a song, and I don't know if it's a song you created or someone else created, that describes or details or just represents what O Block was like the best at this point. I got a lot of songs describing what it's like. And I got my album from the drop in of July. I got a song called Woolon. It's gonna describe it's gonna describe not just that but the whole community. Uh, how it is and why O Block was like how it is. Is there a name to this album? The Prince of Drill back again. How have things changed today? What's O Block like now? Now? Yeah. It's. It's just, it's just different, like a. Uh, like a tree that's going like like dead because the leaves gone and the leaves represent all the people and the mamas stuff like that that was in the all, everybody lived in there so it's just breaking off because everybody dying everybody leaving moving so it's like a uh I say it's like a tree that's breaking apart. Yeah. From your time growing up in O Block, what's the most important thing you learned or the biggest lesson you learned or just growing up in that environment, what do you take from that? What's Just thinking back and, and, and surviving that, what did you learn from that experience? What did that teach you? Is there something overall out of maybe several lessons or several things you learned growing up in that environment that you, learned, that you want I, to share? I learned a lot of stuff. I learned, I learned, I learned survival and how to be, how to like, to maneuver, I learn. I learn people, cause different types of people in there. So you seeing all type of characters. I ain't gonna say cat, but you get. I'm saying like characters, like everybody got their own ways about them. So I'm learning people, different types of people, how people is, fake people, uh, real people. You got upfront people. Got scary people. You learn. You, I'm learning all type of stuff now. I'm learning hustling. I'm learning surviving. I'm learning. I'm learning about the ways privacy, uh, police, how they treating us. I'm, I'm learning all type of stuff now. It's just. It, it it growing growing you up fast, cause you seeing so much. 
Care to share what age you are now? I'm 25. Speaking of growing up fast, even though on paper you're 24 years old, yeah. what age do you feel like though? Do you feel like you're 24 or do you feel like you're much older than 24? From what you've I mean, learned. I feel like I'm about 30 something. <laughs> I be feeling, I be feeling old sometimes, but I know I'm young, cause the numbers. But I was, I was seeing and probably doing stuff that people that ain't even twenty was seeing or doing. It's stuff I'm doing now that people that's thirty and forty ain't seen or did. I'm going out the country, all type of stuff, going to states to states. That's that's different. And if it weren't for that block, I probably wouldn't been doing none of that. Because I wouldn't have nothing to tell a story about or catch people attention from. So it, it grew me up and it and it grew me up wiser too. So it's, it's, I be I be feeling I be feeling old, even though I'm young, because that's the environment. Grew us up too fast. We was doing stuff, seeing stuff that grown people ain't even seeing or doing.